guys this is gonna be my affordable everyday makeup look very simple very cheap i have a list of everything that i'm using down in the description if it's not in there that means it wasn't affordable but an affordable dupe for it so i'm just not gonna put it in the video so let's just start off by moisturizing these lips i already did my eyebrows our lips using this rose hip oil i get this from my beauty so my local beauty supply store and it works wonders on these lips girls so let's just go ahead and what i want to do is prime our skin with the maybelline baby skin this is also the price is also down in the description below i got this from walgreens and i'm almost out of it and this is kind of like my favorite oh my god my favorite primer ever and i just put this and y'all y'all don't need a lot of this because a little bit goes a long way um but i'm running out because i just had it for the um i i don't think i put this in the description because i forgot it i looked at it last minute but this is the nyx um liquid illuminator i put this in the high points of my face so under my eyes and like on the corners of my eyebrows because that's where i highlight the most so i really don't want to just dry my eyes with the la girl pro concealer in fawn what i'm using the powder that i'm using to set the concealer is the ulta press setting powder um you know of course you find these at Ulta the y'all know I love my Sasha Buttercup so the happy birthday palette I got it for um my birthday all for free so I don't know how much it retails and it's not on the NYX site and it's not on the Ulta site so I'm sorry I can't tell you guys how much this retails for but um yeah that's just the background on um you know how i got this palette it, i have these two palettes um they both retail for 199 i got these from a store called city trends and i was actually surprised when i um got this because i was like yo this joint is like look how pigmented that is for 199 like uh, 199 you're not going to get a lot but you get a little bit out of this palette but first we're going to use our sensational lash well our maybelline lash sensational hydro fuse mascara and girl we're gonna get these eyelashes right together y'all have so many fun videos for you guys um but let's get on to the eyelashes so this is the eyelashes that i have i got these from tj maxx for 7.99 they were a five pack but i lost the first pair these are the glam wispies and they look just like this pretty and then i'm using the imv super stronghold um eyelash glue this retails for 3.99 also at my local beauty supply store so i don't know the one thing i hate about these these are like the thin the one thing I hate the, the one thing that I hate about them are the fact that they are so thin. Um, but they look when I'm going for like that natural look, they definitely do the whole entire job. So I guess I can't complain too much. But I hope everybody, all of my subscribers and everybody that's watching this had a beautiful happy new year filled with love and affection honey and all of those good things but you guys see how beautiful these are though now before i was using hair glue to put my eyelashes on but um yeah that eyelash glue is too much of a super hold for me and when i go to take them off they're like really hard to get off and i do not like that they were like stuck to my eyelashes 
And I was like, what the heck? So, sis don't use that. I know they use them in like the beauty supplies and the beauty supply and like the nailery, whoever, whatever nailery does like, um, does eyelashes. But if you're a beginner, I definitely do not recommend that you use um hair glue i would just start with um like a super hole glue that dries clear it's as good as you're gonna get so i'm just gonna apply the other one girl you're not really supposed to use your fingers to apply lashes but girl it's late but today I'll use the NYX total control drops just a little bit not a lot cuz girl this stuff is really really full coverage going back in with porn. Gonna do one straight down the nose bridge. Y'all seen that? I'm not gonna edit that out. Okay, so. So, that is light. We're not, I don't bake, cause, well not every day I don't bake, no. But Maybelline Master Chrome Molten Gold in the color 100. Let's kind of powder it out a little bit. Um, this is the Maybelline Fit Me Loose Finishing Powder in the color deep. You guys see how full coverage this is? So, <laughs> anyway, let's go into this, um, the sprayer face with this Rude uh, Makeup Lasting Setting Spray. We're just gonna... LA Girl Lip Pencil in the color... Cocoa and the NYX Pencil in the color Nutmeg. So, I'm gonna start with the Nutmeg first. And the reason I say moisturize your lips... Uh, before you know you do your lip combos because it makes it easier to put on your lip liner and underneath the lipstick matte lipstick or whatever lipstick that you're wearing it makes it um easier to put on and it's not so dry So the lip that I'm using today is the lip gloss from Wet n Wild. This is in the color Rose Gold. And I just put it right over top. Yes, hunty. So I am all done with this affordable makeup look, this everyday makeup look. It just with a different, um, I would use a different lid color. But, you know, when I do do my makeup on the weekdays, this is the look that I'd be going for. Very natural, very lightweight. Like, it doesn't even feel like I have makeup on right now. So, yes, girl. Uh, make sure you check out the description. Make sure you go and get you some of these products, especially this highlighter, because this highlighter is popping. I love you guys. I will see you in my next video. Bye.